Today, jury selection began in the Limestone County Sheriff's criminal trial. So far, it's all happened outside of the public eye. Media was banned from the courtroom, and we're still working to learn why. This is brand new video of Sheriff Mike Blakely leaving the courthouse as day one concluded. He's facing an 11 count indictment on theft and ethics charges. Court documents allege he stole campaign donations, got interest free loans and solicited money from employees. He has pleaded not guilty. Way 31's Alex Torres Perez is at the courthouse now and she's live with new information about the jury selection process and what she's been able to uncover from outside the courtroom. Alex. The Limestone County Sheriff Mike Lakely actually entered and exited the courthouse from these doors behind me. But unfortunately, it's all the whole entire jury selection process has happened behind closed doors. So there's not much we really know about what is going on. However, we do know that 500 people were summoned for this trial. And with that large of a group, attorneys were expecting to go through groups of around 130 people per day this week. And that's why they were told to go to the new veteran museum where there's a lot more space. However, the Limestone County Circuit Clerk says the group is considerably smaller than originally thought because many of those who were summoned are now actually excused. He couldn't say how big the groups are now, but they are small enough to move all proceedings back into the courthouse. This morning on Way 31 Law Call, attorney Michael Timberlake went over the jury selection process. He said both sides are interviewing potential jurors to figure out what biases they might have and whether or not they can be a fair juror. Both sides are going to try to eliminate the people they think have a you know, predisposition or have already made up their mind or that their biases, their personal biases are, are going to be such that it's going to be you know, not fair to their client. Now, we do not know what kind of questions the attorneys are asking these potential jurors because, once again, we are not allowed inside that jury selection process. Some of the reasons we were given for that was space and the lack of security at the new museum. But now that it's moved back to the courthouse, it's unclear why the judge isn't letting us in. And we have voiced our objections to the circuit clerk. Reporting live in Athens, Alex Torres Perez, Way 31 News.